Google Classroom provides the most efficient and effective way for using Google Meet with a classroom of students. In order to enable Google Meet in your Google Classroom, you'll first go to the gear in the top right hand corner of the classroom in which you would like to use Meet. When you click on the gear, locate the general section in class settings. At the bottom of the general section, you will see generate meet link. When you click on this link, a specific classroom meet link will be provided for this Google Classroom. After you've generated the link, you can decide to copy it from here so that you could paste it in an email if you chose, or reset it if you're having difficulty with that Google Meet link. This is very rare. Underneath, you will now see a toggle button. This button is for you to decide whether or not you would like to have the Meet link visible to students. I'm going to save so I can show you where this will live. If you leave this on, your students will be able to see the Meet link in two locations. The first location is at the top of the Stream tab. You will see Meet link. Anytime you have scheduled a meeting, they will be able to click on that link and connect with you. It's also available on the Classwork tab at the very top. They can also click this button to join a Meet with you. This Meet link is available to all students who are members of your class as well as any teachers and co-teachers. Here is the benefit of using this Google Meet link within Google Classroom. A teacher of the class will need to start the Meet before any students can join the meeting. This teacher will need to wait until students have exited the meeting, close the meeting, and then students are not allowed back into the meeting. The advantage of this is that students are not meeting in a video conference without a teacher of the class present. This is a security feature that is a wonderful way to ensure that good instructional collaboration happens in these video calls. This is the preferred method for using Google Meet with students. If you determine that you would prefer to turn off your Meet link for students, what you'll need to remember to do is when you have scheduled a meeting with them, you will need to create an announcement, an assignment, or some sort of post that includes the link so the students won't be able to click on a link to join the meeting. Here is something I like to do. I like to go to the Classwork tab and create an assignment that has a due date. And I give it a title, type in any instructions, and then you'll want to add a link. Here, you can paste in the Google Meet code that you copied from settings and choose Add Link. So you'll notice now the meeting is attached to this assignment. Then you can give it a topic, a category, and I like to put the due date as the date and time of the meeting. So I'm going to set it for Tuesday at 1.30 p.m. So now you'll see class meeting. So all the students have to do is click on that and click directly on that meet link and they'll be able to join my meeting. That way, if I have it turned off so that students cannot see the meet code here and can also not see the meet code, you'll notice there's a little icon there showing it's not visible. That way they will be able to still access the Google Meet via a class assignment or announcement. This is entirely up to you. It's just whatever you'd prefer. Just remember that you have to generate that link in your settings before this will be available to you. So Google Classroom makes it very easy for you to be able to safely use Google Meet to video conference with your group of students.